how do you keep so grounded and not let it sort of get above you? Um, yeah, look, I, I suppose it's I'm probably very lucky to just who my family are, who my friends are, and stuff, because they'd never let you, uh, they'd never let you get out of yourself. They wouldn't be long telling you, like, if they thought you were changing or you thought things were maybe getting to your head a bit. Um, so, look, just trying to stay as humble or whatever you want to call it as possible, because I suppose, look, the day you, the day you believe you have, you've done it or to believe you've made it or whatever, it's probably a day where you stop, stop working hard, really, and you, you, you know, you, you start changing as a person. So, just being very conscious uh, not to let that happen, you know. How long did it take to park the All Ireland final? Um, like in some ways probably still hasn't been parked and then others because of just other things in life between family and work and club games and everything do you know there's maybe a week where you don't think about it at all and then there's some week where you think about it every minute so like it's just look it's it's, it's very difficult and also some things don't go well personally as well then it's even more frustrating Um, so yeah like uh, not sure if we'll ever really be over because you even hear that from every, every, any other sports person they always remember the losses that's probably just, probably a, not, a, not a great thing to do but that's just what we do um, so I'm not sure if we'll ever fully get over it but uh, so, so do, 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 the beauty of Gaelic football is you have so many other matches that you kind of have no other choice but to try and put it to the back of your mind You're chatting to Brian Fenton there and James McCarthy and it's nice to see them 